The Christmas holiday brought a brief respite to opposing armies during World War II in that, official, in, in that an official ceasefire spread along the Western Front on Christmas Eve 1914. So um, the sentence as written is not grammatically incorrect, but it doesn't uh, do the best job it could of describing the relationship between the two events, namely um, that it was... Uh, that it was because of the unofficial ceasefire uh, that there was a brief uh, respite to the opposing armies. So here we're looking for really something more that's uh, the best way of putting something or gives the clearest relationship between something rather than something that is just grammatically correct. Luckily these types of questions are relatively rare on the GMAT, but you do need to be, you do need to be prepared for things that are more about style than they are necessarily about um, grammar. So, uh, choice B, um, Christmas holiday brought a brief respite to the armies during World War I spreading an unofficial ceasefire. So again, that's true. Uh, it did spread an official ceasefire, but it doesn't uh, give a relationship between the two other than saying that they both happened at the same time. Uh, Christmas, hol Christmas holiday brought it uh, when they spread an unofficial ceasefire. So they doesn't really have an antecedent unless it's the armies, but of course, that's not really what the sentence is trying to say. The armies didn't actually do the spreading. It kind of passively spread. So this one is kind of changing the meaning of the sentence. Let's get rid of this one. Um, D, uh, it brought brief respite to armies during World War II for an unofficial ceasefire uh, spread along the Western Front. So for uh, has a um, little bit rarer use, meaning because. So here we have a causal relationship. The second thing is what caused the first thing. So this one's promising. Uh, and then E, armies during World War II, uh, so uh, the Christmas holiday brought a brief respite to opposing armies during World War II by the spread of an official ceasefire. Um, but of course, the Christmas holiday didn't um, do this itself either. That's giving a little bit too much agency to one day out of the year. Um, and so uh, in this particular case, it's, I mean, I suppose you could say this is uh, a little bit more metaphorical, but uh, choice D is a much clearer and um, much less poetic way of describing it. The unofficial ceasefire, ceasefire spread. Um, the Christmas holiday did not actually spread. Uh, well, I guess, I guess the original sentence is saying that it brought a brief respite. Uh, but by the spread of unofficial ceasefire along the Western Front uh, it implies the means rather than the cause. So uh, for this one, it is choice D.